Hello and welcome to an update video for Open Computers. Today we want to take a look at the new features and changes that have been introduced with the 1.2 update. To have computers and components use power, the Universal Electricity 3 core is now required. The same energy systems as before are still supported, as long as Universal Electricity 3 is available. Possibly the biggest change is that slots and cases only accept items of a specific tier now. A tier 1 item can also be inserted in a tier 2 or 3 slot, but not the other way around. Also new are the CPUs. These are now required to start a computer. Existing computers will have stopped running after the upgrade to 1.2 and will not start until a CPU is inserted. CPUs are required for the computer to be able to communicate with components. The higher the tier of the CPU, the more components can be connected. Another new feature are servers. These can be used to access more than 16 components at a time and can additionally be accessed using a remote terminal from anywhere within the range of the server. The number of remote terminals that can be used with a single server increases with the server's tier. Servers must be placed in a server rack. The radius in which the remote terminal works can be set in a server rack GUI. A higher range means a higher energy consumption per tick. To connect a remote terminal to a server, shift right click a server in a server rack while holding the remote terminal in your hand. Other modules can now be loaded with the command require. Modules that are not part of Lua itself must be referenced in this way. So for example, sites and colors have to be included with require. The HTTP API has moved from HTTP to Internet and offers now also the option to create pure TCP sockets. Instead over the wireless network card, the Internet API is now available if the new Internet card is installed in the computer. The shell now supports pipes and redirects. That means files can be used as input streams for programs the output of one program can directly be forwarded to another program and the output stream of programs can be directly forwarded to files. The manual of programs can be retrieved with the command help program name. The block drivers for the command block, node block and the redstone emotion carriage controller were moved into the open components add-on which also makes a large number of blocks from other mods available from the adapter. If the native library is not available, LuaJ is now used as fallback. In the fallback mode, the status of computers is not saved and the memory is not limited. This was the overview of the changes. Thanks for watching. Until next time.